My name is Hiroshi Ota. I'm a director of Hitotsubashi University Global Education Program. I'm going to talk about this program called HGP with this presentation slide. Hitotsubashi University Global Education Program, HGP. HGP is established in April 2010. This unique program designed for both international and Japanese students to study together at Hitotsubashi campus. The majority of the courses under this program are taught in English, except Japanese language courses. HGP is open to all students at Hitotsubashi University. Hitotsubashi University students are from over 60 different countries and regions. And also faculty member has various international experience and background. What is HGP? HGP offers interdisciplinary courses in English. HGP has wide varieties of subjects taught in English in social sciences. HGP is collaboratively developed with four undergraduate programs, such as business, economics, law and political science, and social sciences focusing on sociology. HGP offers opportunities for Japanese students and international students to learn together. Many HGP courses are small size valuing faculty-student interactions and in-depth learning experience. Also, quite a few HGP instructors are called lectures in practice. It means those instructors, they are lecturers in Hitotsubashi, at the same time they are business persons and still active business persons in the real world. They provide pro practical knowledge through their instruction along with theoretical studies. Hitotsubashi University has three components of courses. One, specialized courses offered by four faculties, such as Commerce and Management, Economics, Law, and Social Sciences, focusing on sociology. Two, General Education courses, offered by Center for General Education. Three, International Linkage courses, offered by Center for Global Education and Exchange. So, those black diamonds indicate courses offered under HGP. Means, four main faculties offer courses, specialized courses in English. Center for General Education offer also courses in English, Center for Global Education and Exchange offer, offers courses, introductory level Japanese language, and courses conducted in English, and also courses to learn academic skills in English. As I said before, 
introductory level Japanese language courses are taught in Japanese. This slide shows, depending on Japanese language proficiency, international students can take courses taught in Japanese. For instance, if a student has an intermediate level Japanese language proficiency, can take intermediate level Japanese language courses and also undergraduate courses taught in Japanese. If the international student uh, has a high proficiency, advanced level Japanese language, can take courses, Japanese language courses at advanced level, also undergraduate courses taught in Japanese. HGP consists of these four types of courses. Type 1, for all students, courses on world and Japanese affairs, offered by Center for Global Education and Exchange and Center for General Education. Type 2 for all students. Those courses are specialized courses, mainly on social sciences, and some courses are also humani courses in humanities. They are all conducted in English. Offered by four our faculties, such as business, economics, law and political science, and sociology. Type 3 Type 3 courses for non-native English speakers. Those courses are courses about academic skills in English. Those students, Japanese and non-native English speakers of international students, can take courses on academic skills in English. Type 4, type 4 courses for international students regarding Japanese language courses and the special courses on Japanese language and culture. These courses are conducted in Japanese. From now, I'm going to talk about HGP course list. So, please first download HGP course list from HGP website. Top of the course list shows legends that explain how to read the HGP course list. Hitotsubashi University, we have semester-based courses and then quarter-based courses. This ZKPSAW represents these terms, different terms. Medium of instruction also indicated in a course list. JPN conducted in Japanese, ENG conducted in English. Also, the HGP course list shows each course offered by what department, what faculty. GE means general education courses. CM offered by faculty of commerce and management. E means course offered by faculty of economics. Something like this. Again, these faculties and departments are undergraduate program. So, when postgraduate students take HGP courses, please consult relevant graduate programs office whether these HGP courses graduate students can take or not, or also those earned credit can be counted
toward graduation requirement. This six different terms also explain the, this diagram over here. So spring semester, at the same time, you can, in the spring summer semester, you can take summer semester-based courses and also quarter-based courses. In autumn winter semester, you can take semester-based courses and then quarter-based courses. This slide shows meanings of those symbols. This triangle indicates courses are graduate level. It means open to graduate students and undergraduate students. I would say this courses with triangle means high level, advanced level courses. If you are exchange student, you do not have to worry about other those symbols. And those symbols are basically for degree seeking students. This slide shows courses of Japanese and the world affairs and humanities. This slide shows HGP courses in business. Courses are offered by Faculty of Commerce and Management. Here are HGP courses in economics. Again, please pay attention offered term here, offered term. Economics courses are many of them are postgraduate level advanced courses for both undergraduate and postgraduate students. This slide shows HGP courses in law, international relations, and sociology. On this slide, you will see a course offered by social data science and academic skills in English courses. These courses are designed to strengthen students' English language skills for taking classes in English. Courses in Japanese language, you can see that this list if you want to take Japanese language courses, you have to take placement test and then follow the guidance by Japanese language instructors. If you have a high command, advanced command of Japanese, and then if you are allowed to take seminars in Japanese, you have to register for this seminar on measuring subject. HGP offers introductory to intermediate level Japanese language courses. 
Besides those courses, there are many other Japanese language courses available in upper, intermediate to advanced levels. So, if you want to take those advanced level courses, please go to the website here showing Japanese website and English website to, about those courses and follow the instruction there. Okay, that's end of the presentation. For any questions regarding the program, please contact Educational Affairs Division or me. This slide shows two email addresses. Also, uh, you can check it out, the program website here. Thank you very much for watching this presentation.